Sponsored by Vakil 20. Yeah, my people, no, 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 the thing they worse, more more. The more we they talk, the more the thing they worse. So today I know I never get time to even talk most of the thing. But now I pray may God give good and may the animal shit work out. We'll go straight to the reason why we are here. No time, okay? <laughs> Our brother will record Sheriff where we want to represent PDP. Oh, there are yes, Sheriff Obey, Obey, worry. We don't know say name not be Obey, worry, no be who worry. They say all oh, his certificate, his document, it is a bar, it is a young. Say the things we submit for high neck, they're not complete. We have here now. And they kind the guy go court. For court, I call ask him, Sheriff, Alpha. You should say the thing correct. Say, but I'll be quotient. I get everything. If you have a behalf of rap, a speaker, everything. Now call. Say, I get everything. Say, be quotient. That's okay. As we reach there, they call the answer. Hello. Now you get this certificate. He said, why not? May I borrow? Then it's okay. We share secondary school. You go where you take get this certificate. Say, now our ladies. Now they judge this scattered the case. Our ladies. Oh, boy, boy. In school, I'm a terror. I'm and then they take winner. Now they don't disqualify her. Say, you know, you know, you know, eligible to run or qualify. If you visit a daylight, oh, they got Judicial matters. A federal high court in Abuja has declared the candidates of the People's Democratic Party, Sheriff Oborewari, not qualified to be the party's flag bearer in next year's governorship election in Delta State. That judgment was delivered by Justice Taiwo Taiwo who agreed with the plaintiff that Mr. Borewari ought not to be on the 2023 governorship election for the PDP on account of allegedly supplying false and forged documents submitted to the Independent National Electoral Commission to aid his qualification for the governorship election. The judge subsequently directed INEC and the PDP to recognize the plaintiff, Mr. David Edebie, as candidates of the PDP in the 2023 governorship election in Delta State. But in a swift reaction after the judgment was delivered, the Speaker of Delta State House of Assembly and state PDP governorship candidate, Sheriff Oborewari, called on all his supporters to remain calm over the judgment of the federal high court. His appeal was contained in a press statement by his chief press secretary, Dennis Otu, who claimed that there is no cause for alarm as he is set to appeal the judgment. Woman, the reason why they read this news is not because of sheriff, not because of anybody, and because of data state, the full PDP. So now, no say sheriff certificate them not correct since ITB speaker for almost eight years. ITB now, nah, now nah, because so now one made David enter David not even for primary now. Nah. Another do one say it is not correct, and this man now still there as speaker. So waiting not correct, he document not correct to become. A governor candidate, or a document not correct to even rule. I don't even understand this country. People certificate not go correct. Nobody that they even they want. Nobody that they arrest. The thing they continue. It's like when they use us, they trade. Woman, I be put a song. 
The guy never no win that time. You don't come outside. You're the time where your age go take the scene. You never delete the video over your page. You don't know how to bring a come outside. The time where you take the compose to the sing your age now nah, outside nah, country. You they say you are sheriff. Now nah, sheriff, sheriff never get certificate. Why well, borrow a certificate to a whole week back for if you worry, go can go borrow your your, your certificate. No, no, no. And then be back You understand now? Nah? So Delta State people, this news now see for now. No carry to say, hey, I stand for sheriff. I stand for hey orange. <laughs> orange, my guy. I could have feel for orange now. Nah. Hey, orange. The sheriff no good. The thing go red though. Go, you run leave your guy. Usani Bian, Usani Bina don't be deputy. Orange, you know your son, all your put your picture with my guy. Because every time I they post sheriff, even for your dream, sheriff, show sure, sheriff, read Bible verse, sheriff, chapter seven, verse seven. I call the feel for orange now. Orange because we go now. Uh, orange go jump follow now. Oh, this life. They want one place when I say no. <laughs> <laughs> if you be politicians from top to bottom, eh, for Nigeria, all of them are not fear this country. I don't care who you be, whether you be local government chairman or councillor, what seven to ask of rep, senator, governor, to president, and the rest. All of them have failed this country. This is a disgrace. For the past how many days now, nah, people they send me this video. I just watch you now. Nah. For prison, for for capital city, the bomb It is a key to Now the waters. Now they call the shamu na run come area area. Shamu na run come they attack us. So they say the people there for three hours. Abuja where I'm in barrack there even on that bridge there everywhere there for three. Because I also three day for that Abuja. When you any tree, you see barrack, barrack, seventy battalion. Nobody. This country is a joke. And now over how many people run. So they now they call the ask the area people. Alpha, when I see any criminal way pass here, when I ah, person when they talk. Now when I pack list of people, say one ten, book a ram, more help now they find them. He will me when over shop, be left foot. Make a call help you find all this Boko Haram. Just they put the picture. Make a call help you find all this one. Where they do face like who go fit key ghost. Make a call help you point there. Make a come outside and know where they do. It's like when they use people life till they play. All the people where they kidnap, they do all those things. When another be catch these people, all the ones where they blow whistle, where they blow whistle, whistle blow her. Men in a day, they prison. When I do say blow whistle, if you see any money, blow whistle. The people go report them for now. All alone. I go see those way tell now. Say money they there. Many of them now they prison. Now you go talk. Those of you never watch this atrocity, this stupid something we happen for Nigeria. Oh yeah, regardless of. Rearrested inmates of the medium security custodial center Kuje are returned to the facility. Officials say over 443 are still at large after the attack and jailbreak. Considering the profile of some of these criminals who are terrorists, there is enough reason to worry. A look at the external view reveals the horror of what happened. Burnt vehicles, including buses used to convey suspects to court and other utility vehicles litter the premises, some still smoking. While none of the officers of the center will speak on camera, we were told tales of how a first wave of attack orchestrated through this hole at the back of the building was foiled by gallant officers. However, the terrorists reinforced and made a bold entrance, blasting through the main gates. The casualties of the attack are security agents and four inmates. Forensic experts are also seen trying to piece together evidence to help reveal the identities of the attackers and the kind of ammunition used. The facility also welcomed government officials who came to see things for themselves, including President Muhammad Buhari. He was given a tour to see the destruction firsthand. Some speak to the media. Everything is under control. The people who came to do these uh, activities, from the records, we believe that they belong to a particular group. And most likely, they are Boko Haram because we have sizable number of Boko Harams that are in detention and uh, presently we could not locate any of them. All the number, I think there are about 64 that is in the prison and none of them now is available. They have all escaped. Well, basically I came in this morning 
to commiserate with the Comptroller General of the Nigerian Correctional Services and his colleague of the Nigerian Civil Defense, as well as His Royal Highness, the Gomo of Kuje, over the incident that happened yesterday, and also to commend the gallant officers that tried their best and also to sympathize over the death of a very fine gallant officer from the Nigerian Civil Defense Authority who was gone down by the criminals. Residents of QJ community gathered in different groups discussing their experiences of a traumatic night. The medium security custodial center QJ is the most prominent government facility in the local government and they want it adequately protected. It, it was actually terrible. Um, at about um, 9.30 to 10, I got a call from a friend. We were talking and prior to that time, I was on headset, Bluetooth headset, so I was dancing to music, but I heard a lot of noise. I thought it was these um, fireworks and, and all those vanguard and all of that. So when I got the call, I dropped it and I started conversing with my friend on the phone. And I told her, okay, see what's happening. It's like they are shooting outside. So I went close to the, the window in the parlor and I put the phone on speaker. Can you hear what's happening? Then the next thing I heard was like a loud bang. And it shook the, the roof, it shook the windows. I had to run into the room. And then I knew this was serious. And that was like, let's say 10 o'clock at night, 10 p.m. yesterday. But basically, it all boils down to the ineptitude in the system. Our security system has been compromised. And along the line, uh, there has to be an holistic, there has to be an holistic uh, uh, overhaul in our security apparatus. I repeat, there has to be an holistic overhaul in our security apparatus. Because if this kind of a thing can happen in a place as sensitive as Kuje, it means nobody is safe. While the attack at the facility in Kuje, one of the most secured in Nigeria, leaves a sour taste. It comes on the heels of previous ones in Imo. Kogi, Edu, and Oyo State. However, it is expected that following a first-hand inspection by the President, there will be enough political will to ensure that correctional facilities in Nigeria are adequately secured. Wamlena! On a night country, yo. This is on a real country. All the politicians, you know, they eat, leave the country. The one who will pay me, the Senate President, put her, where you shot like Shocky. Like Willow, you don't watch that thing. You be like they are descendant. You come outside, they say so. No, no CCTV in the prison. It's like you know they stay in Nigeria. You be like say you they stay uh, Pakistan and then they take beg you come. It's like now transfer. You be like say politics for Nigeria. Be like transfer. They transfer you come from Chelsea Football Club, come play ball for Nigeria. You say so now they need to put CCTV. We need to equip. Are you serious? As Nigeria big rich. The most popular black city in the world. They are prison, not get CCTV. Even if you get CCTV, what do they talk? If you get CCTV, safe. Which light they want to empower? Nothing. Country will light, you nothing know, get light, they won't get CCTV. They go on a see on a light. On our own country, none of the none of the do like say. On other people's country, when I cannot do just one thing, we don't to say, okay, this government come, they do one thing. All of them, I just they do road. I want to say, when a spiritual road, road, school, road, school, road, school. We have one who pass the road, go, we don't know. We have one finish, we finish school, we have one to work, we don't know. Road, school. Now, a person will come finish school, finish university. No, but we look at what they do. Because they see, in those days, when we look at pigeon English, they speak all those things. Alpha, customer. <laughs> But now they go say, oh, how are you? And you woke up, <laughs> okay, we'll be there. If you see, if you see the Queen's English now, nah, not beside the carol, and people where they tell me, you understand now? Because anything where they talk now, we're going to look me. Now, nah, Yahoo boys, all of them go to tie. If you see where they speak English, they walk, hello, yeah, when they come somewhere where I arrive, I see shoe, because no walk. Full Nigeria, no light, no CCTV. We just, they use, we just they play this country, we just they turn around on the same circle. They won't go straight to Daniels, no time. Country night, they're never ready for life. Okay, you know, I'll drink my tea. Now, leave tea. I'll be cut out. Those of them now where they spend, they give gay. 
They say the trainer, <laughs> are the trainer make it for right. <laughs> okay, there. They don't break one of our colleague's heart. As I say, you know, now so the guy the breach. Like a person will go say a kidney for UK. You know, breach. He said they train one guy, see the on their neck, because they mm, hello, the guy say, ah, yes, I want to make all of us dead. So, okay, I will do it. And then once that the guy say, no, I need to focus on my education so that after everything, the guy say, no problem, I will sponsor. If I'm like, they tell us, oh, this is the love of my heart, the apple. And it's okay. 2019, I said, they pay school fees, they spend. 2020, 2021. Three months for the girl to graduate. Now the girl right later. Hello. The way they see this relationship, say, I'm not sure say feel strong. I hereby cancel everything. Just go and search for your dream. Now the guy now they cry now like a guru. We not see water. They cry like frog. Those of the river water. I'm <laughs> 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 Eh? Mm. 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 Yeah. Emma P. Pochamo, 2019, 2020, 2021, 2022. Baby Jamma, eh, Nikuru, no, 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 Dalawa, Dalawa, my mother was a class seven, my father was a primary school teacher. Baba, 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 okay, Mucha, Mucha, Mara. Every other month, I should rent, I do shopping. My mother, for the benefit of giving back to me. That is devil. This devil. This devil. Baby, may God bless you. If you now go eat something, not use your mouth, they cut her. If you will not say they go break your heart, not carry, just go into a relationship with full heart. Ah, it's my guy. What if you pay me? If you wear a mate, they cry. As we are, I will say this side, they go, so I don't know, say they go cry. They get the grand interview, they call the girl name. And I don't say the girl name will be love it, because this is happen for Kenya, because love it will not. Now when you answer love it, I don't know get love so. You understand? Know, nah? I don't know so now attack me, so I will block on my page. I should say the girl in a love it. You know, you're the chop boy, money chop boy, later you say the boy is not my class. I they eat him on this things. I know him money in your class. It's not good. Not the only boy, only boy, only girls they do boy. Boys I see they do girl. Some girls now sponsor to get everything. I say, no, 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 no. The way the girl they do, he got too big. I got to drill like this. But that time, where you, they, you know, where you get a tip in my mouth, they call you. Yeah, I don't you know, drill like this. You understand? Know, Later, you know, you got to find fault. One of the Bobby big pass one. The Bobby, they're not too complete. I should say that they can, you know, you know what I mean? Someone has stopped her. What do you know if you do? Remove your hand. If you go for business, just last day today, now, nah. now, Bolingo, let me come home. You understand what I mean? They go understand. No time, I'll go straight to that news. Midway, my. I didn't like break people out, <laughs> Our ancestors, whether they call Lai Mohammed, <laughs> the guy don't call plot another record for us. He go BBC Pigeon at the interview room. I don't know, say this guy, they blow Pigeon like this. He Pigeon even strong past my own. Now, there the man called to ask her one question. Wait, let me want to read this news. He said, for this government, we're not this. He said, see me the rate now. 
Like, how, how you go fit a radio? He said, ah, they go radio. He said, they try. He said, you sure say you will not try? He said, they try. He said, if anybody never read them, he said, they be like a lizard. We go for, come for a rock or tree. Nobody to hail and go shake and say, guy, we see try. He said, if you now, if you say, if you now, if you do pass them, make me call try. He said, because they, they try. Those of them never walk, shan, wait, the guy, they play this full video, finish, and never cut down. Oh, yeah, I regard the love. Recently, the governor of Zamfara State talks, say, make uh, the citizens, say, make everybody, whether na dang gun, whether na cutlass, whether na na small knife, say, make them carry them, begin to defend, defend themselves against bandits. What do you, you think about this kind of talk where the governor talk? Na bad talk. Everybody take cutlass, everybody take a uh, gun. How you going to know the thing you go one day with that gun and with that cutlass? If he, if he don't fit, uh, fight by bandit, if you come and kill him with that, what do go, go, governor what you should do? He say make you support police, make you support the uh, army, buy them vehicle, buy them gun. You know, he say make you just fold and say, throw, 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 throw away his arm and say, make everybody go get gun. You won't create no problem. But some of these uh, governors say, where you they talk, they make them buy uh Support police. They never even feed pay salaries for their state. How do they go support police when they never feed pay their own workers? Now, them sabi what they do with the money when they no feed pay, pay pay their people. Now, them sabi. But not the work of federal government to defend the people. Now, work of state government. Ha. Make state. Uh, whether it be state or whether it be federal, whether it be local, who they suffer the insecurity? Not be everybody. When I did the gun station, I know what we do for military. We know what we do for police for the sake of making people sleep well. Very soon now, now time for for uh, uh, office go soon pass now. Now go soon come out hand over to somebody else. If they say make you mark yourself and this government now, how many uh, score you go give yourself? Say ah, plenty, well, do. plenty, oh, plenty. Because you see, our case be like that of a uh, uh, lizard. We jump down from a local tree. He say if nobody go congratulate him, he will congratulate himself. We are commending ourselves. Ah, we do well. We do well, my brother. Even if many Nigerians don't believe so, we not do well. Make them come try. We do well. Before I enter uh, seven years ago, I know say so it go hard when not, when not they fight to enter that time. Ah. I know say so, so the work go plenty when not they fight to enter. Ah. We, we, even, even if we don't know, we know say the people where they there, no go fit continue. If they're there, they think go worse. Well, no. Never see her to tell you, look, you do face like wilderness. I don't just see what you they tell you. They, they talk now, they say you insult Okbako uh, Rere. This one, a country, you won't try. Not be the same PDP, salty battle, now we see this so. Boko Haram, now I did that, now bandit join, kidnapper join, they the bomb prison now. This one, a country, the same suffer, no light. This one, a country. Because say, you know, they walk around, or they fly. Police, the guy do nana. And if you say this on a country, you just did as minister of information. No better information when they bring come. No work when you don't even bring on this country. You just did that minister. Only where they they talk bad, you just come. Social media is killing this country. Like this, only down one. Maybe just your own. As you don't do as minister of information, wait to be the job we don't even do. May they forget the president, you. Do face like uh, she tough for Ghana, so. What it be the work where you don't do? Where you, you take the pride of yourself saying you do for this country? Don't go straight to all that news. I don't see nonsense. I don't sleep where. Well. It feels like it goes away, commit suicide. <laughs> this news now for mama and papa. Those of you now where they born children, when I know if you take care of. When I got to say that the senior picking or senior daughter or senior son, I will take care of the children for now. This one now, now, now news for now. One guy will be 33 years old. He go city. My man of you, they take care of the she driver. And then they say, hello, have you post your sister and make her stay with you? The guy say, why not? Post and come. The same blood sister, not even half, oh, the same mama, the same papa. And they post the nine years picky given. Had they post the nine years picky given, the girl could they stay with her. The girl could they wear short, short tea. If you are here, I'm going to call you on bone from nine years. 
Then you start to vandalize the gear. Twe, 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 twe. If you don't go take things, take tramadol. Go dagger the gear rich. Where the gear rich 15 years. Go even for guessing her sister. For there, go even give her belly. Hospital where they carry her, go even kill one table. Now, there, they go even take the hands the gear. Who be evil this your guy? How old are you? Say 15. Who give you belly? Say my, my, my blood. Blood brother. Eh? And then they deceive the guy, call her coffin, give her 20 years in prison. Those of you remember what you're talking about here. Yeah. Rigadilla, man. If you're waiting for me, I'm going to be a good one. You're 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 going to be a good Samo Elom Abebiu, October Busume Neda Netosu Edun Wotri 2019. Eni edinu koko jina ase ni biya. Ema kote edi na sema obuwa na fo. Se onko onko da efiasi enfiye edriyono. Enye juma den. Enfa nsum gana bayna enya di sunya die. Enfa emano. Na ebra wadi atemwe emano no. Nache se ope nina watina edwem se piyem. He wase ki koto. He yehe ana reta abro kwa doku ono. Ene di aso chini infinishia edriyono no. Ema abrante ya samo elom abebiu se. Wadi moja fradia na onko da efiasi enfiye edriyono. Na onye juma den. Na enu na abrante ya samo elom abebiu. Na lawyer for a say, a woman said warm clients no affirm, then so as such ya, with him waffon at the man on a no she, and to a mukoye appeal, our criminal division, a cry high court, a bra justice leader or semafo, etna a semno esso, na justice leader or semafo, etna so our appeal no emono, and warbeka say, a brand tena fum, and pa. I was a sochin a commano, nan so a sochia, ninian edi kind edi manon, natchesi, a no she, and sis an et ye dia, na ombeshe, no matter so edi a mano. Yen fan ko yen famra ewa pil no emono, se se di a brant ye samo elum abibu ni tia ye na lawyer for a pilum de epi efi ma bane se na so chini ya tiso edi ako in fi enum sa onko dem na onye juma den fansum gana ban se oni ono anka se ni nua ban nimpon ada ama nyin se epie mu na otemuafo a otena asem ni so ni mpre ni so justice leader se mafo se de enti a man enfie num no opese abrante no otumi epie ba ntem esan se odi akoda abewi ase so oni ni nua ban anyem ama wawo Enti so awodi ana akoda na odi na bewi ase no ese fata se obehwe no enti omo yire so chinchin a chin so onko dam infinhia du no a na akoda a oni bibia na odi na bewi ase no akora no ebeba bebere enu ntin wo hunu moba aso twen infinhia edu no no wate so e di aba infinhia edu ma enei wode asem no aba beto edwa womena na na because of the pikin where they born now they dey beg judge they won't reduce and call 5 years so that me could take care of the piki. Now, nah, now nah, my problem, now nah, my question, now nah. the piki, now nah, he uncle, now nah, I be he papa. I don't understand. There are some kind of things. Some people they don't even need to bring her come. But when I go say, oh, they don't know what to. There are some kind of things. They know they are like some kind of situation. Now, 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 now. See the kind problem where they born this piki. This Africa. Let's see piki go stay another country. This Africa. Because they say, come over here. Your man will go that guy, he brought that way, they born you. You be your papa cousin. Your papa, nah, your papa, nah, your cousin. Now nah, your ah, guy. Africa people, those of them where they dag on a sister. We know the shame. And all this one are small, small children. And all this mama then. We know you know, say some people will they play with their daughter because say they be niece or they be cousin or they be brother. We know you know, they say, oh, they go. And you know all these small children, biscuit, granite. Peppermint, all those the bread, tea, the one way they danger pass, the one way they give indomie. Oh, you go finish all your children. Any uncle way they give get indomie and egg. <laughs> so I beg get picky. Whether na na a, a, a brother or na a cousin or my niece, always despite the girl with them. Not trust any picking for anybody. Even Papa na the dagger picking a call. You understand? Na? The game don't change. Go straight to the no time. <laughs> for the past so many days now, for Ghana, I answer on my, my fans that they call me. Say, Panana, bra, 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 bra. I say, what, 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 what,
He said, nurse, where they, you know, say for Ghana, they declare names, names, and we are nurse, and they declare names. I don't know who teach our two English. Show. He saw the nurse for Ghana, eh? they don't travel, remain only four, and the four now two, two old women, one upcoming nurse, and one small nurse. Say so for the full country now for Accra, now four nurse, they now the hospital they share. If you go all those hospital they now, Nurse, they now they beg them. Hey, beg come now. Say everybody just they wrong. I say what did they happen? He said for full Ghana, no nurse go fit us. Say they save one thousand Ghana cities after expenses. He say not day. One thousand Ghana cities is like hundred k. But for Ghana things they expensive past Nigeria. So hundred k for day. Job like in a ten thousand naira you they spend. He said they go go as nurse and Ghana people many that they seek where where. No feeding, no allowance, no transportation, nothing, nothing, no accommodation. They go day, day, day after everything, money where they go get, no go reach 200 Ghana and go remain for their salary. And government, they use their thing, they play. So, and you know, say, embassy fool, UK say they need us. Uh, when Qatar need, US need, that's all of them, now don't run, go. As I talk, so those of you remember, what shall they talk about? We got the lava. Pen you know yet it's any a year perpetual of for we ampofo. What just said now saying, said the nurse if one the midwives for what Ghana said, or more caught a ingress in America, a UK, no, and now some get to a crumb, and one walk up, and one walk up, and depending on one and son, now what you want to be able to say, ah, now it's Yaraba, where here you see, oh, it's Yaraba, or call UK, or call 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 your jumaho, just a mukosa, sad yet, yeah, dear, so mukosa, and your call airport, or more mukon, no, my animal, and take one, do one, why a nurse for any midwives of one would ya war. Who saw Miss Adam come so condition of service for Ghana and one yet? Ye muya, ye juma, ye and then Shreni, and Tiamo mo come, mo fi free sister, and Mamma says, No, a hajanipa, and na mammy perpetua, and dear to Duchess, and ya ban ye bibi. One who ban a sad yan, I bibi, and yes, sir, and you are how any yen ye beba, and ya much the beba, and the a jumano, a sin to any beba, pa, a free say, and there's a forty midwife, see, or when a boy, I will sub ya pomodinus, ye more money qua any more, so be ya any at the nequa. Omo ne di kai eshe nwo ansa na doctor ba besim enti saba enti ne ni ansha wo iye na ya mo mo ni ama nkosu iye na condition of service ni ya ni ni ya mfa mo mo eni ebe mo dudu nwo akọ ama nwo hajuna wasi enye kura na obi so mo sa de enti na mo kọ mo si oh o kọ America mo sumi akatu amejin wa hase nwo e ye ti se ho no mo be times ten what ya se e ti na che se ho no mo no ye kura ye fa 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 better e che Ghana. And what is a year chrono? And to a much him says, Send your name as you call us a bayam, mum, ah, ma, a nurse, if was it some one, ye, ye, na, ye, and Timia, Shaman, na, ya, corno, ah, ma, for fun, and for more, Shemudia, that cremetsi, and you none as Niba, Coco, and Ghana, or when you are calling Gracie, a be called land, a be called London, maybe the money at your US, a bit of money at your cutter, and Portogo, Togo crown, Beko, what I say, and to a much him, sir, by any be found, and yes, I dear, and the Amucha Cassia Beba, and the more my apple with this and Beba for. Woman, the guy who come one way go UK, is our father side. He said after spending, he said they get over five hundred pounds. Five hundred pounds in Ghana will be like almost five thousand Ghana cities for five hundred pounds. He said now he said they get after our strength like this. His wife never start to work, so if your wife they work now, that means you go overseas. You see, so he go even tell people me they run come because Ghana won't kill them. Those of them who watch the girl will tell you the interview here. Regardez la ba. 900 Ghanaian nurses left Ghana last year to the United Kingdom. It could even be more. I've been joined by a Ghanaian nurse in the UK. We'll call him Samuel for today's program. And Samuel, thanks for joining us. Good morning. Good morning. Thank you for having me. How long have you been in the UK? Just three weeks. Okay. So how, how long were you in Ghana before you left? How long? How long were you were you working in the nursing field in Ghana before you left? Oh, I worked for like eight years. I see. Why Why did you go? Oh, really? Actually, uh, the, the the country. I don't want to say. Actually, the country, things was very, very hard. Things was tough, especially for we nurses, for health workers. So uh, we, we, there, there was this opportunity for nurses to 
just go through some exams. You go through the normal process, then you can join. So I had to work my way out and come here. How did you hear about this opportunity? Oh, I've had other colleagues who had gone already. So they told me about it and I joined. And how long did the process take you between the day you had and when you finally left? Uh, it, it could take you six months to a year. I see. So how has it been since you got there? You've been there for only three weeks. How has it been? Seriously, it, 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 it's a good place that I would want every nurse, like every Ghanaian nurse, not even if you don't want to like work here, just have a and an experience here it's a good place seriously how different is the work experience in the hospital you are working from the place you were when you were in ghana how different mm -hmm. a big different for seriously. example like you 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 have everything you need to work with nobody is going to tell you we have just a box of love for today so we should manage i don't know if you get what i'm trying to say so there's no shortage have, of like the, the basic things you are getting shortages of when you are working here. You don't have that. You have you have almost everything you need to work with. And how are the working hours? How is the workload like? Oh, let's say you have the hours you need to work in a week. Me, I'm to do uh, 44 hours a week. So you arrange me. I go 12 hours a day. Which is 11 hours paid, one hour break. And how, so, how, how does the pay work? So, um, is are you paid per hour? Yes. Do you care to tell how much you are paid per hour? A minimum of 12 pounds an hour. That's a minimum? Yeah. So, there could be other benefits? So, I said a minimum because mine is more than that. But I'm seeing a minimum of twelve hours. Ah, uh, twelve pounds. So somebody can, so somebody can get fifteen. Somebody can get twenty pounds an hour. Somebody can get twenty. Somebody can get eighty. Somebody can get fifteen. And and does it come with like uh, health insurance and other things? Yeah, at, at the end of the month, you pay your tax, you pay your NI, and other things. So when will you come back? Come back. Yes, to Ghana. Oh, I will come back. Let's say if I need to come and visit my family, like my oh. parents. But to come and work that one day. Uh, <laughs> oh. <laughs> uh, so if government increases the cola, they say government, they, they, your colleagues say they are looking for 20% cola. If they give that cola, mm. won't you come back? The, the, no, I won't come back. I won't come back. Let's be frank. I won't come back. What will it take for you to come back? Uh, and work and work for your country. The 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 the, the, uh, the 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 leadership should give us good reasons, like better job uh, working uh, conditions. You see, when I go to work, I don't buy food. I get food for free. Even if I want to have my supper there, I can't. Because when you go to the kitchen, you can request for food. You get it. And most of the problem with us over there is uh, accommodation, transport, feeding. That is what I realized before leaving. That's in Ghana. The problems three are solved when you are in the UK. Yes. Even though you need to pay uh, a lot for like accommodation but it's reasonable because at the end of the month you know you are going to get something good because when i was in ghana <laughs> uh, let's say in a month you won't be able to save like thousand or thousand five hundred in a month did i say thousand five hundred yeah and thousand. this you couldn't so in ghana you couldn't save thousand cities per month based on your if, salary no i couldn't I had to do extra job to to save to be able to save thousand cities a month. Yes. But how much are you able to save now that you are in the UK? Per 
per the little calculations and stuff that I've done, I would be able to save more than 500 pounds in a month. Hey. And so then comparing 500 pounds to Ghana cities, you know, you are hitting around 4,500, let's say 5,000 a month. Hey, that means that the house there, you build it before. <laughs> oh. <laughs> <laughs> Just say you can start clearing the land and start organizing the house because the the five hundred pounds is like four thousand eight hundred CDs. So that's like five thousand. So you can send five thousand CDs at home to home every every month. Oh, you don't have to because you need to save here too. Ah, you save it and then when it's a lot, you do the project. You get so it. you won't come back. Oh, I. For now, you see, I have, I have. Uh, years ahead of me that is I have a contract with my employer so if I would want to come back I need to complete this contract first before I but isn't the weather cold when I was in UK I didn't like the weather it was very Santa I had to wear some things under my trouser because now the Charlie the winter no some way or you you have you've been there for only three weeks so it's not your cold <laughs> oh we are in summer so it's so it's, you're happy it's fine <laughs> and the food too, I didn't like the food. The, the food was some way, or you are okay with the food too? Oh, the food, there. Yeah. Actually, I brought uh, Ghana food, so when I come home... <laughs> you mean you fortify yourself with shito? <laughs> oh, yeah. I have shito, gari, those stuff. Jesus, so you there, you are, you, are, you are prepared for the long haul. <laughs> <laughs> oh, but seriously, uh, the leaders need to do a lot for nurses for health workers because they are really really doing a lot there so are they read this news not be just for ghana even nigeria people just they run everybody don't tire this year so take nigeria now eh? the people where they, they say they get one thing whether they approve whether they give notes either way they won't travel away the uk people they need now now they call they suffer them to give the that thing now they the wicked they very soon they start to do now for for Ghana, they call the wicked. The people call bribe, bribe face before. I don't forget the name, but all the nuns know which how they talk. Did they say? Huh? So this one now, they read this news. They give Africa leader, especially West Africa. What did they do now? Nah? It's like not only the politicians now nah, be human be for Africa or for West Africa. Not only the politicians now nah, they give wardrobe allowance like this. Like say that they do better thing. It's just like only the politicians now nah, be God, now nah, be angel, now nah, they now nah, nah, be human be why the nurse, the doctors, the the uh, lecturer, the teachers. When I call they look, they like say they not be evil people, and those are the people we even they we even even need to take care of. You don't understand? Nurse for outside, see the way the man talk. Nurse they eat for for hospital, they, they eat how many times a day? But yeah, how you even they eat? Everywhere they smell, not you know. I don't know where the country money they go, and now we spend pass phone. Now we buy phone, I pass cars. Now we buy pass cars. We will buy two thousand dollars for US. We can't come here. We now say we pay three thousand dollars to take Clara. We the wicked ourselves. Where all this plenty money they go? We know they know. We the pay that. We the ah, waiting now uh, African leaders. Now the nuns don't they go remain only native daughters. Now we the we we the treat people here now native daughters. And Tradomedica. When I try to fix things, I'm going to drink my drink. I know if I know kill myself for Africa people. <laughs> for Japan, not be smart thing happen. One former prime minister, the way it don't rule for how many years? Now it don't rule pass. <laughs> oh, yeah, now it's a for radio. They say, where the guy they go campaign for the new people we won't come. The one campaign, you know, the way of Basajo and all the rest, they see the waka, guru kere. <laughs> Somebody like that, now they, now they poofed so. As they go, because they speak Japan, they tell them, they say, I want secure the agent, they say they secure everywhere. Is that on a show? It is secure on you, they say they secure. As the guy, they give speech, they give speech, they don't say one guy. They say when I'm former, uh, when I'm army, I've been navy. Only the guy produce the own gun. The gun get two head, two two place to take we bullet with the pass con. You saw the tail rapper. And the guy they told him who changed the fan. If we only na ete jeke yomi. The guy light down from back, light in neck. Uh, before they say me they die, the guy he already shoot the guy. 
And they shoot the guy, the guy they die, they go save, and they call the shot. No, but now tell me, sir, it is secure. They say it is secure. He said, my backup is of Savena. Before they they rush and reach hospital. The guy don't give up. Do something, don't ever watch out. Oh, yeah. Regardi Lama. And we are following breaking news out of Japan. Former Prime Minister Shinzo Abe has been assassinated. He was shot and killed during a campaign event in the city of Nara. The suspect is in custody. So here's a live look at Tokyo now where the country is reeling from the stunning news. Japan has some of the strictest gun laws in the entire world and gun violence is extremely rare. Video captured the chaotic moment when Abe was shot. Witnesses say that he was making a campaign speech when the attack happened. Security officials then tackled the suspect and arrested him. Authorities are still trying to determine the gunman's motive, though, but there are early reports that it may have been personal and not political. Meanwhile, leaders from around the world are condemning the attack, and our Elizabeth Palmer is reporting from Tokyo. Shinzo Abe was mid-speech when suddenly two shots rang out. His security tackled the gunman immediately, but it was too late. The former prime minister lay on the ground, bleeding with a chest wound. Police say the suspect is a 41-year-old local man, Tetsuya Yamagami, who formerly served in Japan's armed forces. Local media report his weapon appeared to be a homemade gun. The critically wounded Abe, shielded by a blue tarp, was medevaced by helicopter to a local hospital, but officials already knew that he wasn't breathing and his heart had stopped. In Indonesia, Secretary of State Anthony Blinken expressed support. Our thoughts. Our prayers are with him, with his family, with the people of Japan. Uh, this is um, a very, very uh, sad moment. Japan's current Prime Minister, Fumio Kishida, visibly shaken, told the nation, we cannot accept that this violent act took place during an election, the foundation of democracy. In the strongest terms, I condemn it. Although former Prime Minister Abe was giving a stump speech in a wide open area, security around him wasn't particularly tight. After all, this is a country where yearly gun deaths typically number in the single digits. Abe was Japan's longest serving Prime Minister when he left office in 2020 due to ill health. A polarizing figure, he was a right-wing nationalist and conservative and a fierce supporter of Japan's military. He fought to amend the country's pacifist constitution in the face of the rising threat from China. While in office, Abe met former President Donald Trump several times to reaffirm Japan's military and trade alliances with the United States. His political opinions were controversial, but the country is united in shock and sympathy at the news of his death. Woman, uh, now African leaders are they read this news for because on a visit on a buy juju on a day like this on a gentis, things go wrong get soon. Because now, now all these bandit, all these Boko Haram, where they attack innocent people, they attack like this. When are not they take care of so? When are they follow the place so? Very soon now. They will call the increase their something. Now they don't go prison, Abi. Very soon now, this campaign, they will call the target on her. Because you know why? As soon as the fish say, make we not drink water, put cup, dance, and I will not be we will cause the problem. Now we go tell this, oh, now just did them. When I just did them, see the look. Oh. Now everybody don't get gone. Bump now. Full everywhere for Nigeria. Same thing we happen to this man. Who they say during the time where they rule the guy, the guy say, he life burn. Now that pepe, I now they, now they brutalize us so. Mona the phone say no be on be like this, nothing they touch you now. Army they guide you now. Now those army, those police, now go very give you information out. As soon as no one do Africa away, me on a job they use us, still they trade. PDP go form fight with APC, APC go form fight with the Labour Party, Labour Party go form fight with any. Mona just they form fight like that and for night. Now they do it on me they drink tea like me. They do. I can't say, man. No be prophecy. Now what thing must happen. And if they turn on, if you say na lie, oh, oh, no worry. Una go wrong very soon. Now I'm phone on until they rule. From outside country, no, until they rule this Nigeria. Because this one where the terrorists they grow, they come. When I know if they take care of so, now they look out, they go, now they look out, they go so. <laughs> I so rock the bomber one day. Mona just wait. I just they talk, oh. No, besides they instigate people, because later on, now DSS, they say, you talk something, no. Because now Zabi arrest innocent people, but people with the break prison, hey, what you talk, prison? <laughs> This is a language, I can just hook for my mouth. 
What do you want to go to school? Rich? You see, day yeah. here. <laughs> yeah. Hey, attack prison everywhere. So, <laughs> okay, then. It is a guy very soon. Go straight to Dan, use no time. It is a tabia. This news now for my data people. I don't know about another state because now they know they use I, they see Percy property. Especially Kyo Kyo. What I mean by Kyo Kyo, my real worry people don't know what you are the talk. So, I'm out with your woman, Kyo Kyo. Any small thing, Kyo Kyo, don't do Kukuruko. And that's the same, I'm not the crew for night. Kolona was she be out tea. And I don't sing, and I don't go keep people vow. Far away, this guy key. Now the ten sentences I go prison for one month for US. Now they ask the guy, what did the foul do? He said, any time when they call the foul, go they attack and say, what did they do you? What did they do you? He said, so in they won't protect his life, maybe the foul don't kill. <laughs> God, this US, eh? not even person don't go see. He said, now I carry wood, take weapon as self defense. He said, so he go call a lucky shot. And if I were you, then you never would think die. Since so now the team sent us, so now you don't come back. Any guy do something. Get ready for this story. A Florida man is speaking out after a month in jail. He's accused of killing his neighbor's rooster. He says the rooster attacked him, and he was wrongfully imprisoned. But his former friend says that is not the case. I didn't know to give it a 21 gun salute. CPR, mouth to mouth, you know, or call the chicken ambulance. Big Roo was Jason DeFelice's pet rooster. That is until James Nix hit it with a stick. So I'm defending myself. You know, I was feared for my safety and the chicken, you know, uh, d died. Nix says the rooster attacked people. I have not heard that because I know the neighbor here. Uh, I know him. Like, we're, we're friends. <laughs> he never said anything to me about it. I did tell him, after the chicken hit my dad, I said, hey man, the chicken attacked my dad. Oh, what's it doing? It's just a chicken. What's he gonna do? You know, okay, well, look. He says the rooster followed and attacked him. His neck flares up, and he's doing his thing, and he's trying to jump up at me. And I try to hit it, but the chicken's jumping up at me, and I accidentally knocked it in the head. You know, call it a lucky shot, whatever. But when Dave Felice came home, all he saw was his rooster dead in a ditch. I said, I'm calling JSO. I called JSO. JSO didn't do nothing. And then a couple days later, I, I realized I could call animal control. And in late June, James Nix went to jail for animal cruelty. Next thing you know, he calls the chicken police on me. Chickens are dying every day, people, at churches, Popeyes, and Kentucky Fried Chicken. Really. Woman, uh... I got the US. Hey! Oh boy. They know if you try that kind of thing for Nigeria, they say, ah, they say this person say because they kill foul. No, be Tifa. Say foul attack, I say killer. They call sentence out to prison. Which lawyer will judge the case? They don't say, ah, oh, you have paid the foul all like this. Guy, no, be say Tifa. He kill foul. Now you might be there go prison. So, so when we reach there, when the president comes down, I say, why are you here, man? He say, I kill foul. You kill foul? He say, yes, self defense. <laughs> I could not. Ah, USA guy. They go call. They even get foul police. Foul police say why you for keep foul like that? Foul police. They protect foul animal rights. Hi. Animal get our animal never get right yo. Eh. Our animal no one don't get right here. For US animal right. He go to foul. Put person for police. Who be the judge? Eh, hey, they go use a good taste swear for you. They will tie you. Before the judge go wake up, you better swell up. You send best begin to prison because of how. They will not be say a thief. He. Sure. Go straight to other news. Nigeria where they eh. Uh -huh. So now they go to the US. So when I am a focus war. If you see for how you they run. Can no one say Panana say money come when they pay your lawyer where they want judge case. What do you do? Say I, I use mistake, keep foul. Oh yeah, nah. you go go prison. <laughs> <laughs> when are they turn and say Nigeria not go feel good because people who go wrong go meet say me they help us now they be our enemy now they they, they give us problem from police station uh, court everything now they be the wala people who go wrong go me say see oh see what he happened to me don't go join your enemy self because they fight you because of say you not get money or you not get large on 
One man get problem with his wife. He can say, ah, what he go do? Make it wrong, go meet George so that he could feel settled there. What he happen? be say, the man, he say, why business won't start, but the business not feel they grow where well. the business they shake, they shake like this black and white TV. We correct, no cash, we we'll return on. Then the man say, okay, me what? Me with five million in all, go with five million in all so that the business will feel boomtalized. When business start to boom, the woman character could change. Could they change like chameleon? Could they change like Bob Risky from black to yellow, from top to bottom? You understand what I mean now? As they change, the man could look the wife and say, What did they happen? Before the woman look, he said, No, the year and the level, the year, this man level. You know, say that time, talk not with the sweet word. The woman could go rent her house for another place, close to the man's safe. Now, from there, the man could say, Yes, some different, different, you know, huh, Jackie Shah. Then they called that they could do training. <laughs> you know, not everything that they talk. Then they could do training, play football with the woman. The tea could repeat the man. The man said, No. Thanks. Sue the woman, say, Me they go court. Without court, go feel no how to threaten the woman. As they reach there, where the judge see the woman, the judge called the guy, they lick tongue. Ah, he called it, they look the judge way. Then the judge said, No, this woman, what you have done? No, 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 no. This is divorce. Go tell the man, Divorce, divorce her, divorce her. The man said, Judge, ah, according to constitution of that, say, Divorce this woman now, you will see what will happen. Mumu man, go go divorce. The guy no ever who work at Richards. He don't hear, hmm, hmm, for the lawyer office. What did they happen? The lawyer, the judge, now called the dead the woman. He can't even do one, made the man not see the, he won't see the, if he won't see the children are from school, I may not pass one hour. May you do high, hmm, hmm, with the children. Now they could do investigation. Before I see the judge, they will give the woman belay, two strong belay, be let long. Now then the guy say, wow, George. He go here, even the judge won't go even one sentence him to prison. Oh God, this country. What the time you say, if you not get people, not carry, not carry jump, they go lost you. Now the man take on social media do video. Video we do this how many years ago. Now now people can see video. Oh, they take a sack George. Those of you never watch the video where the man take the the big Nigeria. <laughs> oh yeah, Rigadi Lava. My name is Olu Yemi Ayeni. I'm a Edu consultant number 44. I go on the road. I had an issue with my wife. She moved out from the house. She rented an apartment very close to my house. Your wife's and, name? Yeah? Your wife's name? Ali. Doni Rukayat Okunubi. Okay. You understand? We did uh, only, we did only uh, introduction. But I was advised by her father that she invested, invested in her business. I, I put five million into her business to establish a school. Kitchen Kitchen Foundation, number six, so you banji, close. Or you offer you look a better. So the, the success of the business caused the problem in the family. I could not control her again. So this led to the problem whereby she moved and rented an apartment very close to my house at Governor's Road. And after 10 months, within two months, men have been sleeping with her. So after 10 months, I took her to court. Thinking that I will be able to resolve this matter through alternative dispute resolution, the judge, Doctor Ishola Azaki Adeyeri, already dissolved my marriage and got that woman impregnated three months after the solution of the marriage. The woman is not carrying nine months pregnancy for that man. What it really pay me that this in the rulings, this this man get obnoxious rulings and deny me access to my children, that I can only see the children at the school premises once in a week. The same children now, I wonder is custody. He took over the business and started for that woman. He denied me asset from having asset to my children. He predated the woman now, and he still want to send me to jail. He has been using police to harass me. He brought police to my office, to my house last month, last and uh, last week, and during the environment I was arrested, taken to Abatio and uh, Police Division, uh, Abatio Agege. We collect with collaboration, conspiracy with the DPO in town, CSP Sumanu. I was arrested overnight, detained, carried to court, court semi as Oba on the charges of assault that I have intention to kill this man. So I was I spent two days at Kirikiri. I was just released yesterday. As yesterday afternoon, the man brought another six police police from uh, Oba and from Chacha to come and arrest me. As a result of that, I had to escape. Presently, I cannot go home. I, I, I take a refugee in one of the hotels at uh, Ikeja. So what I'm saying in Nigeria now, it should come to my rescue, that nobody is above the law. 
I want that man to be brought into the book because he used his office to dissolve my marriage. And I want justice to be done. What I mean now, I want my children back because this man is a polygamist. He has three housewives. This woman now in question, Okunu be my ex-wife. Now this is the fourth wife. I don't want my children to, to, to be under the cause of this man. It's like I allow my children to go and play at Sambisa Forest. I don't want my children to live in a chaotic environment. That is what I'm saying. I want my children back. If I don't care, if Lagos State Social Development can take over the responsibility of the children, I, I'm, I'm financially okay. I can take care of my children. I can put them in the body house. I want my children back. God bless you. Fellow Nigerian, please assist me. Woman those of you who watch the way they toss it, they don't sack the judge. <laughs> oh yeah, <laughs> When people say, I mean, Nigeria not happened to you, we try to, for those of us that are very patriotic, we try not to say it too much because we feel that Nigeria is a good place. But sometimes, Nigeria happens to you even in the most unexpected ways. This story about to take, according to the report, a Lagos state government, I mean, a Lagos state government has fired a customary court member, Mr. Ishalara Zaki Adeyemi, who in 2015 allegedly dissolved a marriage of a man and his wife. The complainant's name is Mr. Ola Yemi Ayeni. The man brought his matter to the court. They see, oh, see problem here and my wife, we want to dissolve our marriage. It says oftentimes we've witnessed or read about similar stories where a mediator irrespective of the gender, eventually turns having an affair with the woman. In this situation, the, uh, the, the, the head of court, the magistrate, ended up marrying the complainant's wife. Ah. Got her pregnant in three months. Got her pregnant, Abby? Three months after in, this. Week. Yeah, three months after what happened. So while the complainant was there saying, hey, my wife did this to me, the judge was looking for, ah, a money girl, yesha. <laughs> Anyways, fast forward, the legal state has sacked him. Because obviously that was inappropriate. But what are your views? Because you see, not the only judge they do this thing. No, custom, police, army, everybody, politicians, pastor. Oh, that one at their job. They, they cancel your wife. They take. They say, don't worry, brother James. I will talk to her. <laughs> Tell her to come to my office. From the office, so I decode them with the power to the And they talk to the woman. <laughs> they don't touch her for. And then they will stretch her. Like snake with a stretch goat. Moon has stopped those things. They'll say, cause settle fight. When I'll settle the person take. Call treat person, you go treat the person wife take. Somebody goes with the woman, you'll get small problem. You say, oh, I won't go down for you. No worry, I'm your friend. You frontalize her take. You need to stop it. You not be God now. The man will not get justice now. They say the children don't come meet her back. Everything. But whether the woman come now, no come now. No, go straight to other news, no time. <laughs> One school for Kenya don't shock Africa. This one I wait here and won't make with the they do. We would they leave our culture. Now one Kenya school they do now. There's this is where they bring this to come to school. The children call the teach, they call the learn this way. They call the, the way they call it, they, they read, they do things. It's because they look the children because they say they like African things and they could they go to school, they could they teach them how to wear Ibo teeth, they do like this. See, the teeth could they affect them mentally. Now they say, no, maybe they dress with their, any of their religion, their traditional things, they call school. He says, since when they start to do that thing, the children brain call increase. Those who never watch this whole thing, oh yeah, regarde la School time in Nakuru, Kenya, and there's one topic that's almost always on the agenda. African culture, language, and dress. Children in Freedom School follow an Afrocentrism-based curriculum that is teaching children to embrace their own culture. Through our mentorship program, we realize children are just studying maths and English without an identity. And we decided to start teaching these children an identity clause, which is called the Afrocentric curriculum, which is the Freedom Curriculum. And when we started doing that, we saw serious transformation. Majority of these children started coming out with excellent results. The school was founded in 2018 and now has over 300 students aged between 5 and 14 years old. Those behind the institution say some Western educational and cultural concepts have pushed African traditions to the back of the textbook. The reason we edify our mother tongue, our African colors and, co and prints, you know, African attire, is because 
this is who we are. Our culture carries our heart, our soul, our mind, our essence. And if we go by dressing how uh, maybe the British showed us how to dress in school, how the British showed us how to speak in school, that is should be an addition. It should be just like more of exposure. It should not be the center. First, we should start with our own mother tongue, our own colors, dressing code, everything, our own Afrocentrism, Africa-centeredness, and then we add. It's an African-centered school. Uh, it is trying to change the African mindset and uh, make the Africans love themselves, know who they are, and just be proud and be ready to embrace their culture. But in my other school, it was very hard for someone to be called with their African name because people thought that the African names are not valuable. UNESCO has long been advocating for multilingual education and teachers here hope that the children's link to African culture will remain long after the school bell rings. Women kudos to this school. Nigeria will get one of the best English. They know one legalizer. PG. For them to speak PG, they go look you say you be Agbero. For them to you do your own to speak your own language, they'll say oh, you be native daughter of PK. We just won't remove our tradition, our religion, our everything. We they go copy on other people. Now be our problem. I will not if we copy where. Check all the Nigerian music where they said they're not be Igbo music or Igbo song. Now PG. All the bona boy where they see where they did that side. So all the David do. Now when they want to interview them, they call it still right when I was I just they look there. Especially that techno where they do face. They do face like he's saying pokpo. I say ah, techno. But when you want to see Panna, baby Panna, I know they hear this accent for your mato. Mona stopper. This PG we will get. We need to use that teach children. If we use PG, they teach any Nigeria PK something. Eh? If you don't know the mass. So tell her, find the S where go this side, then you call boss out here. He calls to lie, they go find a call. But when you do the time, you say, he prepares Y, the Z, and find the approximate. Even the approximate, they don't understand. This thing, they don't understand. You don't understand. So you, they confuse them with grammar. But when you use their language, the majority will know. They do. Now I mean the white children, from six years, seven years, 20 years, eh, 20 years, no. 10 years, like, they know they do phone. They know they do things. As we be Greek engineer, we get there. They go school. They do no one. No one don't produce anything for this Africa because of waiting. Not be our this yet they teach them before they call learn English, call learn terms, call learn like this before they call understand the subject. Now they kill us. But you all use PG they teach us or you use robotic teach us this something or robotic. <laughs> okay, now they use robotic teach me something. There, my guy. <laughs> hey, oh boy. Uh, distinction. I'm going to get for all the papers. All. <coughs> okay. But no, now come bring big grammar. Find the loquacious parachutes of the almighty formula to the. Ah, wait. Oh, no, my head will call for. I'll call the divine something. What did it happen? More embrace our team. See India team now. They see they speak India. Nihi kaban, nishinku, na subtitle that they use. But now, the, the Indian people full Hollywood pass. Uh, and even if they pass, even Nollywood no, never go anywhere for no need. But Nigeria movie, all of them won't speak. Oh, who are you? Who we help? Oh gosh. Oh, you help me. You can call a glam woman. And they're not go anywhere. Speak here, yeah, yeah, English up and down. Hmm. Rubbish. We'll go straight or down in no time. <laughs> One African country don't take award. <laughs> okay, nah. If you hear the award, eh? We will not feel deterred this African country. Before I go do regarde, I'll give somebody eh, 20,000 research card. One African country don't take award as the country will get the highest <laughs> picking the country. This country where they talk for Africa, it take third. For a country where small shit they take get below up and down, twet, 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 from 10 to 19 years. Say the country we take we small children take carry belay from that time. Either so not born or so not like this. For Africa, the for the full world, though, the country take third. If you think guess this country, eh? Before you do the before regard, I go no. Before you go watch the regard, I go no. So not just say, I see this, I shock. I say, how can this country take third? 
for we all know that country day. Those of you know what we are here, regarding Laba. Thanks for staying with us. Now, new statistics by the Ministry of Health released today show that over the last one year, on average, 98 new HIV infections were recorded every week amongst adolescents between the ages of 10 to 19 years. This, they say, has been caused by the triple threat of new HIV infections, gender and sexual violence, and adolescent pregnancies. As Kenya remains the third highest ranking country worldwide with teenage pregnancies, where one one in every five adolescent women aged between 15 to 19 years is already a mother or pregnant with their first child. Safi Gordana Mamu tells us more about these statistics. The Ministry of Health says HIV and AIDS remains a major public health threat for adolescents and young people. Numbers by the Ministry and the National AIDS Control Council, NAC, show rising cases of new HIV infections and adolescent pregnancies. 20% of the pregnancies that we have in the country are of young girls. And these are girls that are between the age of 10 and 19. So this is why this is a matter of such national importance. In 2017, Kenya recorded close to 67,000 adolescent pregnancies out of over 317,000 pregnancies. You know, in Nairobi, we deliver around 12,000 mothers eh, every, every month. Eh? And uh, we project around 156,000 preg pregnancies every year. So if you just look at that 10%, it, it's, it's quite alarming. Nine counties, Nairobi, Kajiado, Homabay, Meru, Kericho, Narok, Kisi, Mandera and Bomet contributed to 56% of all the teenage pregnancies among adolescents between 10 to 14 years of age. When you are chairs and football. As the country makes some strides in ending AIDS in adolescent girls and young women, as a public health threat by 2030, Kenya still faces a ticking time bomb of the large number of women of childbearing age getting infected with HIV. Last calendar year, 2021, we lost 5,000 young people between 10 and 19 to HIV. Adolescents and young adults aged 15 to 29 contribute to 61% of all the new adult HIV infections. July 2021 and uh, end of June 2022, we recorded around 15,000 uh, new HIV infections, which is very, very high. 13 counties, among them, Kisumu, Kisi, Narok, Nandi, Laikipia, and Tana River are counting for 72% of all new infections. In 2021, Dagoreti North Sub County contributed to 15% of all new infections of over 430 adolescents aged 10 to 19 years in Nairobi County. And prevention means that we must talk about the issue. We must engage our community health workers so that they can go down and talk to the communities. Teenage pregnancy remains clear evidence of unprotected sex that carries other risks beyond pregnancies. More than 1.4 million Kenyans are living with HIV as of 2021. Children aged 0 to 4 years accounting for over 78,000 of the infected population. Stunned by the shocking situation, the ministry through the National AIDS Control Council has launched a new countrywide campaign dubbed End the Triple Threat, meant to end the three key issues affecting young and adolescent people. According to the National AIDS Control Council, young and teenage mothers have the highest new cases of HIV infections during pregnancy and breastfeeding and lower rates of retention in HIV treatment and care. Women, how can you take dead? I find who take face, I know, but I don't really know who take face. If Kenya, we population no rich, one country will take dead. That means that country must take first. Just that I don't want to call the country name. If maybe every time person will just call people country name. They call they say para. Why now? Why now? Because I know say that that country now must take first. You see, more teach reproduction system for school. More teach children ah about reproduction, about like this, about sex, like this or those things. When I say no, we get religion. Oh no, no, oh no. Na 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 she dress poor pass and na they get HIV pass na. Those are not the this is more key. Na they get na. 
We go tell Mama, teach children how to do this thing. They say, no, ho, 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 we, who? They call the go let this thing now for our side. They don't know whether the thing bad. They just see the way the thing tastes. Ooh, ooh, ooh. It's a dagger. When you have lemon and now, he meet the talking and now, he could not cry, he dip in the ring way. Because of nobody to teach them. You will visit the novel dagger, they don't wear. No time. You go straight to that news, okay? Bro? <laughs> so, my people, if you like what you are wearing, I also go to run, uh, you just do one like saying an English way. Say, no, every time I'll just do native, native. And I say, Parana, just use what they treat them. Mommy, no, 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 we use <laughs> God. It could be like English words. <laughs> One of the things I know about this, we are Bella. Okay, bro. no time. Parada one talk to do. Mock news one talk sense. Parada one talk to do. Hey, 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 hey. Parada just talk to Peter too. Peter too to pay the bad people. Mock news and tell the people to. Sorry, by Fakil 20.